Listen. It was some sanitizer. <laughs> Stop it. That looks inappropriate for TV. <laughs> what the heck? Surprise, Shade. I love how quiet this chair is. It's real great. <laughs> Okay, so the original intro I have for this video um, has been left in 2020. I don't know where it went, so I'm remaking it now. Anyway, it doesn't really matter though because the intro that I had doesn't really match the video anyway. Uh, kind of decided just not to do any of the stuff that I said. And there's no point in saying what I was gonna do because I didn't do them. <laughs> yeah, so <laughs> this is the intro to the video. <laughs> I'll just see what I did. I went and got my flu shot and then we went to a beach and took a walk around a beach that was nearby and those were supposed to be two different videos two different vlogs I had it edited it and i felt edited why do i always feel like i say that word rude, rude, rude. i already had those edited and i thought they were kind of funny moments i don't know <laughs> you might not but i thought it was and i didn't want to waste it so i need to go pick up my my lunch and starbucks also has a new drink that i think i want to go get Wish me luck, gotta socially interact with people. So I'm gonna do that. And while I do that, I'll just play the clip. It's uh, <laughs> I got a really cool gift <laughs> at the end of it. I don't know, enjoy the day at the beach where we found some interesting things. Okay. <laughs> You're all kind of down at the side. Okay, try to relax. Yeah, it's <laughs> We got our flu shots. We got a little free first aid kit. But wait, <laughs> there's more. <laughs> there's <laughs> Kiva hand sanitizer by the gallon. <laughs> they were like, there's a gallon for you. <laughs> they said the virus ain't going nowhere, so you're going to be protected for life. Wow. Um, let's talk about a gift. <laughs> Free hand sanitizer with your flu shot. I really thought it was water. <laughs> she said, you want some sanitizer? <laughs> Stop it. <laughs> oh, I can't. I can't. <laughs> Not at the zoo. Wow, that's actual seals. Hello. Oh, there's another one. Mm -hmm. Come here. <laughs> I'm out of bed. <laughs> what the heck? I'm sorry, what is that? <laughs> oh no. That looks inappropriate for TV. <laughs> Ew. <laughs> it looks like an alien. Ew, I was this TikTok video of this lady uh -huh. of her husband watching another lady eating a TV that is so <laughs> Why? It was so gross because it was like she was eating peanuts. It was disgusting. <laughs> <laughs> and she was just like, oh, she chopped oh, down. He out. He was dying. Welcome back. I hope you enjoy that little little break, um, little viewing moment. I got my food. I went to Panera and got that. I was gonna have it delivered, but that delivery was it's seven dollars, um, which is more than my meal. So I'm not doing that. And I did get the coffee. Oh, Jesus. The, it's the pistachio latte. I like pistachio, but I feel like they're just subtle. Like it doesn't really taste like much. So 
We'll see. It was supposed to be ice, but my mom also wanted one, and then I got nervous. I asked for, my mom wanted a grande, so I got her a grande, and then I said, can I get the same thing but in a venti? And he didn't hear what I said, so he was like, I'm sorry, what was that? And I didn't rehearse mentally to have to repeat my order, so I got flustered and scared, and then I was just like, can I just do the venti pistachio latte uh, with almond milk? And I forgot to say iced. No, I did say iced, but he didn't hear me because I got really flustered and said it really quick. And then when I got it to the register, he was like, and then the venti was hot, right? And I was just like, yes, it was. I saw it was already made. Like, I wasn't gonna be like, no, it was actually iced and have them remake it, it's fine. Plus it was also the cute barista because I pulled up and he was like, love the curls. And I was like, sir, don't do that to me. <laughs> I'm already flustered. <laughs> I don't know if that's tainting it, but I did stick it in the fridge. I'm not gonna try that now. Should I just try that now? You know what? I'm gonna get some ice. I didn't want to stick it in ice while it was hot and just like melt and get watery. I'm trying to give it the best chance so I can give it. I got my ice. I had to make some more um, and it hasn't really been that long. <laughs> um, not completely frozen. So I'm just gonna take off the actual frozen pieces and hope that <laughs> somehow. I didn't really say at all what I'm doing. But I'm gonna I'm gonna try this drink and then we're gonna talk about resolutions real quick before I before I go and that'll probably be the end of this. Okay. Well that is not <laughs> nice cute. Whatever. And yes I am using I think this is just like a beer mug, beer glass, beer mug. I don't know what it's called. I was gonna try and be aesthetic and use a mason jar, but uh they're all dirty so this is what we got. So I got the pieces of ice that actually froze in here. They're just ice tops. <laughs> I guess I could have took the lid off and did this. It would have been a lot faster, huh? Oh, that's weird. It smells exactly like a pistachio. What the heck? Whoa. Oh, let's just try it. Oh, that's weird. That's weird. It tastes like a blended up pistachio. That's so weird. I mean, it is pistachio flavored, so like, I would expect it to, but I wasn't expecting it to taste so strong. Oh, yeah, pistachio. It's good, I guess. If I'm doing like a holiday drink for like the winter time, I'm definitely sticking to the Irish cream cold brew. Oh, that one is so good. I'd give it like a six out of 10. What's an experience? Oh, happy new year. I didn't even say that because it doesn't feel like anything changed. It hasn't even feel like Halloween's past, let alone New Year's. So let's talk about resolutions. Does anyone do resolutions? I feel like, I don't, I don't know. I don't really like New Year's resolutions. I make them, but like everyone else, I don't stick to any of them. I just don't get the point in it. I feel like if you're trying to do something to better yourself or whatever, then you should do it any time of the year instead of <laughs> just waiting for a specific day to do it. Also, can we talk about the fact that some people's resolutions are to like be a better person? Like, shouldn't you have already been a better person? I feel like a lot more people should, that should be the resolution this year. I feel like stuff like that should just, it doesn't matter. You shouldn't wait till January 1st to just be a better person. Just be a good person every day. <laughs> <laughs> With that being said, let's get into my resolutions. <laughs> Mine, I feel like, are just a little bit more realistic. First resolution, be more social and get out more. Maybe not really so much right now, but at some point, if we are able to do things. I realized I needed to when yesterday I walked in on my mom watching a documentary about people that went to like these like no technology camps and the kid was talking about Oh yeah, like we just talk a lot. And I was like, ew, talking? <laughs> my mom looked at me and said, I should really send you there. You need to practice your social skills in talking to people. She's not wrong. Um, I hate it. Oh, I hate it so much. It is something you need to work on. I do know that. I'm not a very social person. I don't leave my house. If I could stay in my house forever, I really would. <laughs> I've already kind of started today. I mean, I, I went and got food by myself. Granted, it was just like pick up at the counter so I didn't have to talk to anyone. I got my coffee 
which I already explained to you was extremely freaking stressful. But then I also went to the grocery store and picked up some toilet paper. That was a lot, okay? And now I'm socially maxed out for the day. <laughs> I, I feel like I need a nap now, which comes to my second resolution. Get on a better sleeping schedule. <laughs> my whole family, honestly, all have like sleep issues. Like we don't sleep very well. We can't fall asleep very well. And I don't really stay asleep very well. 2020 has really messed up any semblance of a sleep schedule that I had. I've been like falling asleep at like 6 a.m., 7 a.m. And then I don't wake up until like one or two. Last night I did a little better and I went to bed at like five. So we're improving. But it just feels like such a wasted day <laughs> going to sleep at seven and waking up at one. Like that's not, it's not okay. I will never be a morning person. That I know for sure. I will never just wake up ready to go at 8 a.m. At least at two and get up at 10. That's a good schedule for me, two to 10. The next one, okay, it might sound gross, but it's wear deodorant more. Let me explain, let me explain before you start judging and be like, oh, she's thinking. I don't, okay? It's just, I, in 2020, I haven't left the house. I didn't leave the house. So I didn't really have a need <laughs> to wear deodorant because I just woke up, took a nap and went to bed. Like, in fact, I don't like smelling. I don't like feeling like I smell. I don't like feeling like my breath stinks, any of that. I hate it. I like smelling good, okay? Not wearing deodorant doesn't mean that I smelled. It's just, I haven't, I didn't do anything. I didn't have a need for it. But the problem is I've gotten so used to it that when I do leave, I realize I forgot to put it on and then I get stressed. And then when you stress, you sweat and then then it's not okay. And then I come home and take a shower because I just feel gross. I don't smell though. <laughs> don't judge me. <laughs> four or five or four, I think it's four, is to get a skincare routine, like a legitimate skincare routine. I've been watching a lot of Hiram, a lot of like skincare TikToks and like doing my research and I really want to get a good skincare routine, okay? I'm tired of these little, little pimples popping up and ruining my day. These aren't the friends that I asked for. I do moisturize and I wear sunscreen most days, <laughs> but I don't have like a set skincare routine and I feel like I need that. Let me know if there's any products that you like and I should try, but I definitely wanna do that and get into that more. My last resolution for 2021 is to stick to my previous <laughs> resolutions that I have talked about. <laughs> Just that, that's it. Just stick to them. That's a resolution in itself because I am such a procrastinator and I put everything off as you can tell by my upload schedule. <laughs> Let me know if you had any resolutions for this going into this, 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 what is happening today? Let me know if you have any resolutions going into this year or if you believe in resolutions at all, if you do them, let me know. Yeah, so like and subscribe if you feel like it and I hope you have a good rest of your week and I will see you in the next video. Okay, bye. <laughs>